going to see how to download a PDF presentation for your products. Um, the purpose of the PDF would be to either present your products to a boutique or to at an event or um, an exhibit or anything that you might feel like a PDF uh, presentation, a printed uh, document with your products could be useful for. Um, so you can either uh, select one or many products to include. And I'm going to click on download presentation and I can choose to either uh, download the PDF with prices or um, no prices. So it's up to me to decide what I want. Uh, here I'm going to download it with no prices. And um, you're going to have the pop up uh, that shows you what the PDF will look like. Uh, so here you're going to have your cover image that is currently um, in your storefront. Um, you can change it. We're going to see how to do that later. Um, you're going to have your artist name, your bio, and uh, the products that you've selected. So you can just um, save it and decide where it's going, and that's it. And there you have your um, PDF that is ready to go. If you want to, uh, for example, uh, select one set of uh, designs related to a specific artwork and create a PDF just for those um, let's say you can just select all of these and um, yeah let's say these and I go to my storefront and if I want I can change the cover image uh, that it's going to be shown on these on this PDF specifically I can also change the name um, so let's say I'm doing a collaboration with a boutique I can say Daniela and um, oops, Daniela and Le Galeriste. That's going to be, let's say, the collaboration. Um, and the bio, I can just say um, my new products. And I can save. This is actually the same information that is going to appear in your storefront, but it's linked to the download PDF um, tool. Once it's been saved, I can go back to my products and my selection is still there and I can click on download presentation let's say this time I'm gonna do it with prices and I'm gonna see that the information that I just updated um, was added to this PDF so Daniela and Le Galeriste my new products was the bio that I changed to and the products so it's really up to me to um, decide which products I want to include or not. Uh, make sure that you have the right selected products. Let's say here I didn't um, unselect the products that I previously had, so it added them all together. Uh, make sure you only have those specific products selected. And again, you can save it wherever you want. And make sure you go back to your storefront and change your artist name and bio if you don't want to keep the information that you changed it to. Um, and that's it. That's a little trick to um, promote your products uh, event or any other um, venue that could be useful for it.